When I was pregnant with PETA, I would notice that if I had country music on, I didn't feel much movement from her. And then I would flip it over to the Christian radio station and I would find out that she would start moving like crazy. I was like, wow, that's kind of cool. And I'd flip it back and she'd stop. I'd flip it forward and there she'd go again. I thought, wow, okay. And we knew that she was a gift from God because I shouldn't have been pregnant with her anyway. I just can't imagine life without Positive Life Radio. Because of the type of work I do, I'm not allowed to advertise anything. And so the only way that people know that I'm a Christian is they hear me coming because they hear the music that is played on Positive Life Radio. Out in the middle of nowhere, I get to sing at the top of my lungs. I get to praise the Lord all day long. Don't have to worry about if I'm on key, off key, high, low. God doesn't care. He's just happy to hear me singing. And the other thing is, is I, because I have that positive, godly influence in my life all day long, as I'm going along, every single box that I deliver mail to, I pray for that box. I pray for the people in that house. The Bible says, pray without ceasing. I get to do that every day. What Positive Life Radio has done in our family is it has given my husband, who was not a believer, this word in song that was getting into his brain. He didn't know it was getting in there. And um, it's like planting seeds and eventually they'll be watered, they'll grow.